Hello Anil, how are you? Good morning Doctor. Doctor Bina, my family doctor has told me that both the tubes of my wife are blocked and she will need IVF. What is an IVF? See, IVF is a technology by which the sperm of the husband are fused with the eggs of the wife outside the body. And once the embryo is formed, this is put back into the uterus. The pregnancy grows in uterus and finally after 9 months, baby is delivered. So this is the latest technology. This is used for the people who are not able to conceive otherwise. Uh, how long will it take to complete the process of IVF? See, the process of IVF takes about 15 days. Actually, the uh, ovaries of the patient are stimulated for around 10 days. After that, eggs are collected from the ovaries with the help of the ultrasound. It is called ultrasound guided aspiration. Once the eggs are collected, they are fused with the sperm outside and put in the incubator for two days and after two days we put it back into the uterus. It could be two days, three days or five days depending on how the embryos grow. So finally if you ask me the total time taken for an IVF cycle, I think it should be about 15 to 18 days in all. Is IVF a surgery or is it painful? See, uh, basically if you call any procedure done under anesthesia, yes, it is in surgery. But there is no cut, no stitches, no rest after that. We just collect the eggs with the help of a needle which is attached to the ultrasound guide uh, probe. So, I mean, patient goes home within two to three hours of egg collection and patient is absolutely fine afterwards. So, you may call it as a minor surgery because it is done under anesthesia, but actually speaking, it is a very minor procedure. Do I have to take leave from work? No, not exactly. In fact, the day of egg collection, your wife will have to take leave and maybe you also because we need your sperms that day. And at the time of embryo transfer also, she needs rest for a day. If she is able to come for stimulation and monitoring of ultrasound, then of course she will need 15 days altogether if she is coming from outside or if she is staying very far off. But I don't think she needs leave at all because she can come, get the monitoring, then go home to the off go home or go to the office. So it's possible. There is no need to take complete 15 to 16 days holiday. Uh, what is the success rate of IVF? See, the success rate of IVF depends and varies from center to center. If you ask me what is success rate of your center, if you ask me what is the success rate of your patient, I will say it is between 50 to 60 percent conception rate and about 35 percent carry home baby rate. Carry home baby rate means all of them who get pregnant do not go till term. Some of them are bought also. So we have a very good success. It depends how good the embryologist is. It depends how good the laboratory is. It depends how good the stimulation is done. So there are a lot of factors which affect the success rate. So in a, in a nutshell, I will say success rate of my patient and in my center is between maybe 50 to 60 percent and the carry home baby rate is 35 percent. Uh, when will we know if she is pregnant or not? After the embryo transfer, within 12 to 14 days, you will know whether your wife is pregnant or not. If we want to wait for some time before undergoing IVF, is it advisable? See, it all depends what is the ovarian reserve of your wife, ovaries. Every lady has got a fixed amount of embryos in the ovaries. So what happens with the age and with a lot of factors affecting the ovarian reserve, they keep going down and down. So maybe a time will come when your wife doesn't have any eggs. That will be a problem. Because if she doesn't have any egg, how will we do an IVF? So it is always advisable if you know that your wife's tubes are blocked and she needs IVF only. It is better to do as early as possible because young eggs are good and matured eggs and the age of an and the eggs of an elderly lady are not that good. Quality also deteriorates and the number also deteriorates. So it is always advisable to have IVF done at a proper time and proper age. Thank you Dr. Bina. Thank you so much for the excellent information.